wonder what's taking Hank so long. I hope I didn't make a mistake by letting Hank go. I saw. <laughs> Good work. See? I knew having someone on the inside like that would work out. I've already put it in order for the equipment. I was going to ask you to pick it up for me, but there's a problem. One of my guys, Hank Ferraro, offered to go. I tried to tell him he'd be more useful sticking to his job here, but he insisted and he was already on his way out before I could stop him. But it shouldn't be taking this long. Just a quick trip to Gagarin and back. I'm concerned. I could use some help with this. Oh, thanks. This is a huge help. You'll be happy to know I actually carved out some of the budget so I can pay you for all of your assistance. We don't currently have much information to go on. I'd suggest checking with Sidonia ship services over at the starport first. They'd be the last person I know that's seen Hank. It's all I've got without sending you all the way to Gagarin to retrace his steps. Good luck. Gotta be his nickname. <laughs> yeah, he's been through here. Took his ship and departed. Actually, it looks like he came back into Mars space recently, but he didn't land here at the spaceport. The ship diverted and landed outside the city a ways. Yeah, something seems off about this. You're probably right that you need to work this out with your boss. Maybe some wires got crossed. Anyway, good luck and good day to you. Taking Hank so. That's a little suspicious. Why would he do that? Moreover, why wouldn't he return with the goods? Something's definitely up. I asked around while you were gone. Some of his co workers mentioned there's been a little extra, well, Hank lately. In particular, he was cursing up a storm about work and about his co workers. Said some things that make me think his intentions here were not pure. Anyway, he's not too bright. Maybe he's still here in Sidonia. Check the broken spear. He frequently goes there to drink. We need to get to the bottom of this. Remember, it's most important that we find out where the equipment is. We can always deal with Hank later. We've got to do it before we lose track of it, before it gets sold, moved, or worse. And we've got to hope to whatever higher power you believe in that it wasn't jettisoned into space. We've got our work cut out for us. Good luck. Subterranean particle detonation imminent.
Thor's contracts, but I've already hauled more ore than any of the old timers could ever produce. That's rather jealous of me. Questions, huh? Let me buy you a beer first. Here you go. Uh, anyway, I seen you talking to Trevor. What's someone like you doing sticking your nose where it doesn't belong? Oh, do you now? Well, you're not wrong. I do have something to do with it. In fact, I'm the one who took it. I had to. Those guys all think I'm some kind of joke. And I'm stuck with this stupid three-year contract. I can't afford to break it. So, screw Deimos. Screw Trevor and all the other miners. Losing that equipment, the last draw for them. Did he tell you that? One last failure in a string of failures to meet quotas. It'll be layoffs for everyone, and I won't owe Deimos a damn credit. No. Maybe. I don't know. You know what? Who cares? It's my plan, and I'm already doing it. How could I? <laughs> you do it too if your co-workers never took you seriously. I'm always showing them how much better I am than them, and all they do is laugh and talk behind my back. They think I don't hear them, but I do. They say I'm a show-off, that I'm not good at what I do. So screw them. This whole planet sucks. Everyone here is a friggin' loser. Hmm. Shit. You could turn me in. I'd be in jail, and this be all for nothing. Damn it. Fine. You got me. I'll take you to where I stashed it, and we can haul it back. But you better not be lying to me about not telling anyone. Sure, fine. I get it. Just, uh, follow me. We're going outside. Sometimes, you know, and I got good hearing, so I overheard you all talking about this equipment. I knew what it meant to everyone. Let me go pick it up because he thought I was showing initiative. <laughs> it, it, it really was uh, the perfect plan. Sidonia, there's just like nothing around. No one at all. 
What? No. She's never told me about it. Hold on. Is there some big thing everyone knows about that they're just keeping from me? Probably think I can't keep a secret. Fine. I don't want to have anything to do with their stupid Mars harp or whatever it is anyway. <laughs> what? Am I too much for you? Man, I wish it had landed a little. Smell you later. That's enough. Now face me, so I don't have to shoot you in the back. You didn't think I'd just reveal my plan and then let you walk away while knowing everything, did you? Damn, you're dumber than I thought. Shit, you knew. Do tell. What took him so long? Well, I can assume how that went from the fact that you're here and he's not. He worked hard, but he was a dumb kid. I just never thought he'd be that stupid. Or dangerous. It's a real shame. I'm glad you managed to resolve it and get back our equipment. I'll take it from here. You really saved our asses. I'm not sure how I would have explained to the suits that we lost all that new stuff. Thanks. Still looking to help us out. Maybe check with Rip. No. We got a problem we can't resolve. Namely, you know too much. Well, when you say it like that, maybe you got a point. We're way past that now. I know. I'm sorry. I didn't want it to be this way. I just... I felt like I got no other choice. You know? Damn it. You're right. What the hell am I doing? This is freaking stupid, even for me. This whole idea... I, I barely thought it through. I, I just acted because it seemed like my only shot. I really don't want to hurt anyone. I'm in too deep and I don't know what to do. I know I don't deserve it. But will you help me? Please? Hey, I like how you think. You'd really do that for me? I mean, as long as they get the equipment back, no harm, no foul, right? And if they think I got it back for them, then maybe I'll finally get the respect I deserve. Yeah, 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 I'm down for this. Let, let's do it. I swear I'm turning over. What? Your lips? Looking forward to hearing all about this. Any luck? Oh, do tell. Wow, is that true, Hank? Sounds like you really gave it to him, eh? Well, good on you then. Turns out I had you all wrong, Hank. You'll have to tell me all about it later. 
Let's allow our friend here to get going, though. I'll take it from here and get the equipment sorted out. Here's the credits I promised. I'm also throwing in some ore to repay you for what you got us before, and then some. We'll be able to recoup it in no time with these new tools. Thanks for all your help. We couldn't have done it without you. I don't like it, but you might be onto something. If I come clean, maybe it'll go easy on me, especially if you tell them what happened here. Fine, I'll do it. It's the right thing to do. And hey, at least I'll probably void my contract. Gotta look on the bright side, I guess. Sergeant Booth at your service. If you have a security-related concern, bring it up to me. Not if I've got anything. For real, though. I don't know. We get the occasion. Well, it ain't drugs. Nothing to worry about. They ain't as bad as... As much as someone's life. Friends, acquaintances. Be seeing you around. Keep on the straight and narrow, and there won't be anything to worry about. Don't let me keep you. Be careful down near the mines, and enter any you active run a tight site ship, at your own risk. Anyone who steps out of line, 